Ooh, my first audition. Yes, I can. I write about it in my book. I was at Cambridge and I uh, auditioned for the uh, Footlights show that year in the local professional theatre. And that's when I met Graham Chapman. We were auditioning at the same time. And I went out on stage and they asked me to sing. I thought they were being funny. Um, and then when I'd failed to sing, they asked me to dance. I, I thought this was about humour. Um, but they were, they wanted singers, and I, I don't know what they were doing, but it was a deeply humiliating process. Oh, I love that story. Everyone's, everyone's first audition story is really good, actually. Oh, it's yeah, really then, funny, and they stick with you. Yeah, that's <laughs> right. Well, when I auditioned for a Broadway musical, I only did it for a joke, because I'm the worst singer in the world. I mean, I'm just terrible. And they gave me some pages to, to read, and it was a humorous scene, and I was playing an upper-class twit. And they laughed a lot, and then they said to me, can you, will you sing us something? And I said, no. And they said, well, why not? I said, I can't remember any tune. And they said, well, can you, can you sing your national anthem? And I said, I'll try. How does it go? And I sang it badly and went off, and the phone rang, and they gave me the part. Most extraordinary. So I went to the musical director first day of rehearsal and I said, Stanley, I can't sing. And he said, Jan, I've been on Broadway 40 years. Everybody can sing. And 10 minutes later, he said, you're right. <laughs> you can't sing. Learn the lines and mime, because I was only on the chorus. I, so on, in the chorus, I just said, that. <laughs> Brilliant. That's amazing. <laughs>